All right, this is 5757 Suitland Road. We'll do the inside first. This is the front door here. Some ceramic tile on the floor. There's a little bit of a hallway. We got a closet and a bathroom right here in the middle of the of the house. Kitchen back there. Living room over here. Dining room. <clears throat> so um, the drywall down here looks all right. Looks like there might be a little bit of a wet spot coming from here. The rest of the walls look okay. Uh, windows are metal. They're metal windows and they're not in the best shape. They're just kind of, this one's kind of crooked, a little bit hard to open. Yep. So yeah, this whole thing here, closet, bathroom, and then I think that ends about here. And then this is all just kind of, you know, that could come out if you wanted. Just, just a little bit of wall there. Yep. Dining room, same metal windows, thin looking kind of metal windows on the back. Kitchen, kitchen, you know, pretty small. It has uh, ceramic tiles on the floor. The cabinet's looking a little bit old. The top ones aren't. Top ones aren't too bad, I guess. They're just looking, yeah, like I said, they look pretty old. Same metal window on the back there. Here's this half bath. Toilet, looks like it's intact, mostly. Sink cabinet here looks pretty old as also. Let me do the basement real quick first. Carpet's all kind of coming loose off the stairs here. Uh, basement's got good height to it. Basement ceiling is, you gotta do it from the floor. So plenty of height. Seven foot 10, seven foot 10 ceiling height down here. Utility stuff back there. There is some kind of ugly looking texture on the ceiling. A few kind of a little bit patchy spots. Uh, the rest of the walls look okay. A couple little holes here and there. Decent size area here. Sliding back door. Handles busted off. Yep. Some busted up bars on the back there. Little closet. The utility stuff back here. HVAC. Um, some of these copper wires are cut here. I'm not sure if those went to right in there. I don't know. I think that's for the HVAC maybe. Um, <clears throat> water heater looks like it's all good, all hooked up. Looks like it's in good shape. Don't know what that stuff is. I don't even know where the front of this HVAC is. I, I guess it's this is the front. There we are. Seems like it's in decent shape. All right, and there's actually another door here going to the outside that's boarded over and pretty beat up there. And the electric box, electric box is 200 amps. Yep. cover my face because I don't know what this insulation is made out of here. 
So uh, we have three bedrooms and one full bath in the hallway. This is the front bedroom here, same metal windows on the front. Nice bright room here with the three windows there. Let me see if I can do this and keep my face covered. Oh, I need the flashlight. So it looks like all this has been maybe torn out. I don't see a whole lot of wet spots. There's a little bit of wet spots there. Up there looks okay on the top of the roof. And up there looks a little bit kind of dented inwards a bit. So the roof does have some few issues it looks like. That's one. Here's the hallway bathroom. The hallway bathroom has nice uh, ceramic tiles all around the tub. The tub's in good shape. The toilet. It's all there. The sink cabinet looking pretty old. Got this bedroom here. These are pretty decent sized bedrooms for a townhouse it looks like. Same metal windows, trim looks good, walls look like they're in decent shape in here. Ceiling looks okay in this room. And then this last bedroom. This is the smallest bedroom, this is pretty small. All right, now let's go look at the outside. Outside of the house is pretty dirty. We have vinyl siding on the house. And it's the, uh, the end unit on this row. So you can see it's pretty dirty. Um, there's not really any cracks or breaks in it. So, I mean, the vinyl siding, it looks like it's okay, except for it just needs to be definitely washed. Good side yard here, plenty of side yard, probably the biggest yard in the neighborhood. Um, there are some power lines down that way. A little power line way going down there. Side of the house looks good. And there's just woods back here. A bunch of trees and stuff. You can hear a highway back, but it's quite a ways back there. And the back of the house. Side of the house and back of the house don't look nearly as dirty as the front. There's a sliding glass door there. The bars is all screwed up. It's boarded up second back door thing there. And the HVAC looks, looks, looks good. It looks like it's all hooked up. Yeah, it looks like it's in decent shape. It's not rusty or anything. Yep. And then the electric wire stuff here. It's got no meter on the front, but wires and stuff look like it's good. Gutters are up there, downspout. Well, that looks pretty decent. Some of these other guys have decks. Lots of the other houses have decks. Shutters and downspout on the front looks good too. Shutters up top there look alright, no shutters on the bottom windows.
Um, it looks like that one, maybe that one's not. That one's got a package on the front porch, but this one's got, this one's definitely vacant as well. 5761. Here's the rest of the neighborhood here. So not too bad. But yeah, three dirty houses on the end. That one's definitely vacant. There's this house here, it's got some tarping on the roof, but besides that, it's pretty clean. All right, that's it.